guys, so today I'm going to be filming my first autumn clothing haul of 2016. I'm so excited to film this because autumn is by far my favourite season and I'm looking rather summery right now. I've got quite a good tan, I've just come back from holiday. My face on the other hand doesn't look that tanned because my foundation is driving me insane. So yesterday on Bank Holiday Monday, me and Bradley went on like a big shopping spree. We haven't done this for years, like since we were quite a lot younger and we used to kind of like go out and do like a big shop. Whereas like nowadays can't we just go shopping quite regularly and we just pick up a couple of bits here and there. Whereas yesterday we went out for it and we got a so much stuff so I'm going to show you all the stuff that I got for myself. I got quite a lot of stuff from Primark so I'm going to start off with that because I got so many cool things I'm just so happy with all the bits that I got from Primark. So I'm going to start with one of the things that I love the most and this is this suede biker jacket. Literally I am in love with this, cannot believe I got this from Primark. This is what it looks like, it's so gorgeous. It's like a taupey brown colour. It's not too much of like a camely colour, it's more of like a nudie brown. Um, it's a really soft faux suede. It's got kind of like biker details with the kind of bit around the collar here. Obviously probably wouldn't do that up, but it's got that around the collar. Um, obviously got the sleeves and then it comes down with a zip. It's got kind of like pockets here i think this looks really expensive especially when it's on i think it looks like it's from zara or Topshop. i could really see this in zara honestly cannot believe i got this i got it for 23 pounds like what a steal is that i'm so happy with this this is gonna be such a staple in my autumn wardrobe um on the back it's just plain it's got some stitching down it but honestly it's gorgeous i feel like it will go with so many outfits will really add more of like a biker style to it and i love the suede detailing literally i'm in love with this I'm really finding this hard to say. The next thing that I got is this really pretty pink striped shirt. <laughs> it's really difficult to say, it's such a tongue twister. It looks like this, um, it's really really nice, I really like this actually. I don't wear shirts that often but I feel like they're a really nice staple. I also feel like this would be nice like with a couple of the buttons under at the bottom and just tied at the bottom on the waist like with a skirt or jeans or something. I wore this last night just how it is, um, out for a meal with my family and I really liked it. It looked really nice. I wore it with like a little pair of heels we went to kind of of like a posh restaurant it just kind of tied everything together i just really liked it it looks quite smart and i like it for kind of like a nice dressy daytime outfit kind of like a classic outfit or even just like for drinks or something i just think it's a really nice staple to have in my wardrobe the sleeves are like slightly rolled as well and i think this was seven pounds i absolutely love it when people have things on hangers in haul videos so i've got this on a hanger the next thing that i got is this um, and this was a bargain it was on the sale rail for two pounds so i couldn't turn it down it's really nice it's this striped black and white t-shirt it was in an eight so it was in my size and it's got this little tie bit at the bottom so you can tie it up and it goes with a skirt or with jeans or with shorts or anything i'm really sorry if it's loud outside i have to have the window open because it's scorching hot today but there's a stupid car engine revving outside my window stupid as the home delivery outside my room anyway i really like this top and especially for two pounds it was such a bargain a real staple something i can just throw on with a skirt um really really simple and i really like it the next thing that i got is this and this is really really nice it's like a black t-shirt with this really pretty like slinky material to it you all have seen this is in a lot of shops at the moment i have some collots from top shop in exactly the same color and exactly the same material the texture is just so nice it really adds something to like a simple outfit and um, instead of just being a plain black t-shirt it kind of like has something now to it but it's kind of like slinky material i really really like it now this next item is my absolute star of this entire haul it's this jacket from primark and i just absolutely love it i saw this as soon as we walked in and i said to bradley i was like i've got to get this i was like if i don't this is not going to be there in at least like two days never mind a month it is gorgeous it's like this it's a really gorgeous like pale pinky nude color it's got these lapels at the front of the jacket it comes down it's got these little bits here I don't even know what these are called and um, the sleeves are rolled up I'm pretty sure I rolled those sleeves up actually and it comes down it's got some little pockets on the side here and it's just like a long jacket and it is just gorgeous it's got some zip detailing as well underneath the lapels there I don't know if you can see um, but it's just absolutely stunning this was 25 pounds what a bargain like literally such such a bargain I said a lot of times that sometimes Primark just doesn't pull it out of the bag for me sometimes I will go in there and I will literally see like one thing or pick up some fluffy socks or something and just not have a very successful trip and honestly for the past couple of months I haven't found anything successfully in Primark for ages that I really really loved however all of this stuff I have absolutely 
absolutely in love with, especially this and the suede jacket, literally so gorgeous. If you can get your hands on this, I would so recommend you doing so because I think this is gonna be such a huge thing this autumn. Going back to some boring stuff, I picked up two pairs of normal leggings. They had leggings in there for six pounds. I didn't look anything any different to these leggings that were two pound fifty. When I saw them, I was like, six pounds for private leggings. I was like, you're having a laugh. And then I saw these ones, they were two fifty, I was like, they're the ones I want. Uh, but I've got two of these, I'll wear one of them today. Um, but yeah, I just like leggings for like around the house and just when you're having like a chill day or if I'm filming but I don't really wanna wear pajama bottoms, I really like leggings. I also just got some fluffy socks. Um, I got these ones that are like dotty blue and then some kind of like just plain blue ones on the back. I just wanted some more fluffy socks. A lot of mine don't match anymore so I thought I'd grab some of those. And I also grabbed these in the till aisle which was kind of a bit of an impulse buy to be honest. These are called cozy footlets. They're just like little slippers and I know I don't have any and I wore them I wore slippers a lot in Manchester in my house last year and I am moving house this week when this video goes up I will actually be in my new house I'm pretty sure um and yeah because I'm moving house I really wanted some new slippers these are just ones that I will just chuck on. I will get some nicer ones in the next couple of weeks or so, just like some booty slippers or something. But these are just in the till aisle, so I just thought I'd pick them up. They were only two pounds. Now, I also picked up some stuff from H&M and New Look. The New Look stuff, I am in love with. I only picked up two things from New Look, but I am seriously in love with these things. I'm gonna show you those now. So, from New Look, I picked up a pair of jeans. Now, this is completely just like not me at all. Firstly, I'm not really a jeans person, especially not a blue jeans person, and I will only buy my jeans from Top shop um i have really really short legs my leg length's like 26 um so i only ever buy jeans from top shop because they're the only ones that fit me because i can get leg length and waist and like they just work for me whereas everywhere else they seem to be either too long or too small around the waist or too big around the waist and it's just it doesn't work i'm not like an 8 10 12 in jeans um i kind of need specific sizes however i tried these on in new looks so i just thought you know what I'll try them on. Topshop jeans are so expensive sometimes. I just wanted some nice blue jeans. So I tried these on and these were ankle grazers. I got them in a size 10 because my bum is quite big. <laughs> um, so I always have to get, if I do get sizes in jeans, I always get a size 10. Even though I buy 6s and 8s in dresses and tops and stuff like that. Um, so they look like this and at the bottom they're kind of like rough cut. Like they're not really really straight and like nice they're just like really rough cut which i really like that because they're an ankle grazer jean they fit me <laughs> they fit me normally and they fit just slightly above kind of where a normal jean would sit they're not really ankle grazer on me um obviously on a normal person they would be slightly shorter and obviously that's what the style they're going for i would have liked that style on me but at the end of the day i would never fit into an ankle grazer because they will always be slightly longer than like what i am these were 24.99 and they fit so nice i really like them they just looked really nice and I'm, I felt really comfortable in them. I don't really feel comfortable in jeans normally. I normally get the Joni jeans from Topshop and even though I like them, sometimes I can think they look slightly unflattering unless you've got like a top over the top of like where the high waist bit comes. I think they can look a little bit like you're about 13 if you kind of like, you know when you have like it done up and you've got the jeans, they come so high that I feel like you need a longer top to kind of go over the top of them. Otherwise they just... I feel like on me they just look like I'm about 12 um, because I feel like that's what all 13 year olds wear nowadays is like Joni jeans. Um, so I don't know, I wanted to kind of step away from that a little bit and that's why I picked up these and I'm really in love with them. I'm really happy that I tried them on. So if you're like me and all you do is buy Topshop jeans, go and have a look and go and try some more on because I'm in love with these. I'm specifically in love with them with this jumper. Seriously, this outfit is going to be my go-to autumn outfit, definitely. The jumper looks like this from New Look and it's just striped so at the top you've got this really gorgeous kind of like pinky mauvey colour then it goes down to a white stripe and then it goes down to a black stripe and I am in love with this it's got a gorgeous neck it's kind of like a high neck kind of slightly like cow neck but it doesn't come really really low I'm in love with this this was 24 99 as well it's such a nice knit it feels so lovely it sits really nicely honestly my go-to autumn outfit is going to be those two bits because I'm just in love with them. I think they're great. And lastly, I just thought I'd show you the bits from H&M. Um, this is probably the most autumn-y thing in this whole haul. And it's this really pretty camel skirt. It's got these two light pockets on the front and it's got a zip at the back. 
The reason why I really love this skirt is firstly the material is really nice, it's a nice thick material and secondly this fits really nicely on me. Sometimes I have a real issue with skirts fitting me because my waist is really small, it's probably the smallest part of my body, it's my favourite part of my body but I really have a small waist but my bum is quite big <laughs> and so to fit into a skirt either the waist is too big or if I get one to fit my waist my bum doesn't fit in it and it's just really frustrating sometimes and sometimes as well skirts can come up smaller because my bum's bigger it's just a little bit frustrating this one fits so perfectly it comes to a length where I'm not going to be pulling it all the time when I'm walking it's just going to sit nicely on me and um, it fits really nicely around my waist I just really really love this skirt um, I'll just find out how much it was it was 19 99 and I just yeah really like it I think it's going to be a really nice staple and it's nice and plain it'll go with a lot of things I then got this top, which I actually already have in white. Um, it looks like this. It's stripy black and white. I think it is black. Yeah, it's definitely black with kind of these pinstripes down it. And then at the front, it does up. So it has like a tie with the eyelet on it. And it does up. It comes quite low to do up. As I say, I already have this top in white. And I saw it in the stripy black and white. And it was only $7.99. It's only $7.99 in the white as well, which I think is such a good price for a nice top like this. It'll go with so many things. I thought I can wear this on a night out. I can wear this out for drinks, I can wear this in freshers, I can wear this just generally day to day with some jeans or collots or with a skirt. It looked really nice with that skirt I just showed you. And yeah, so I just thought I'd pick this up in black and white as well because I really liked it. And I've worn the white one quite a lot as well. I think they're just quite a staple like top in my wardrobe. And then the last thing in this haul that I got was a bag. I got a new uni bag. This was $17.99 and I just wanted a really big bag for uni. It looks like this. It's kind of just like a bucket bag. There's so much room in it. I'll just show you. <laughs> Look how much room there is in here there's not much kind of like bag to it like it's nice and lightweight and that's what I like for uni I don't need like an amazing bag for uni I just need something that's big and plain it's going to go with a lot of outfits and it's going to fit all my stuff in it and this ticks all of those boxes so that is the end of my autumn clothing haul for now I'm pretty sure there'll be some more autumn clothes coming your way soon um, I really want to make an order off ASOS and also misguided in the next couple of weeks or so but thank you so so much for watching guys if you're not subscribed already then please do the button is just down below also just want to quickly mention that I have been shortlisted for best vlogger in the bloggers blog awards which is so exciting for me I've never been shortlisted for anything like this at all before um, so I'm going to leave the link at the top line of the description box so if you would like to vote for me I would really appreciate it I can't believe I've been voted for it and also the awards is the day before my 21st birthday so it would be the best birthday present ever thank you very much for watching again guys please give the video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and I will speak to you next time bye